Welcome to the 4D Show with Guns! On tonight's show we have birthdays, present of the week, and the Halloween costume contest. But first, put your hands together for your host, Jason Gonzalez! All right, so welcome. Welcome to my basement. Uh, before I begin, let's thank the house band. guys are amazing um, I think it's it's awesome how you can play such great music with absolutely no instruments <laughs> okay so we have an awesome show for you guys tonight um, before I begin anything I want to welcome Christy and Katie you guys are new to our community and uh, and it's a big deal right sobriety early sobriety is, is hard it's difficult there's a lot of stuff that you're gonna go through mentally and emotionally and spiritually uh, and so doing it in a community will provide that support that you're looking for during that time um, so making the commitment to sobriety is a big deal making the commitment to sober living is a big deal making the commitment to that you guys are in the treatment house and making a treatment the commitment to, to months of treatment is a big deal um, and so just thank you thank you for choosing 4d uh, thank you for being a part of our community and whatever you need don't hesitate to ask uh, we're here for you that's what that's what that's what this whole thing is about um so yeah so welcome uh the, that house i think might be full for today at least uh it, we do have some beds open though in the in the guy's house so if you know somebody who's struggling give me a call my number will be down below um just give me a call and, and we can see what we can do hook them up with with something right some sober living or treatment or whatever it might be give me a call let me know uh next birthdays we haven't done birthdays in a long time because we haven't done this in a long time so uh, i missed a bunch here's some more of the recent birthdays that we've had if i missed your birth birthday i'm so sorry about it uh, hopefully we get the next milestone that's coming up in the future for you uh, but here's some some of the recent ones we have maddie or sorry madison who has 38 days hannah b has 60 days drew has 60 days emily has 90 days michael has 90 days and maddie has six months which is amazing uh, i was on the receiving end of, of maddie phone calls uh, about a year ago and uh she she needed to get sober that's the only way i can put it so so happy that she's here finally and, and happy that she's at her six month point that's a big deal for you um i'm super happy for you and, and congrats i'm probably that proud of you that you're here uh, all right so next some some other cool updates that we have one the king house got a sectional a sectional couch i was there when they put it in uh, amazing problem solving <laughs> that, that they that they did uh, so good job Hope you guys like that couch. Dougie uh, has upgraded from not only cutting coupons physically, but now he's doing digital couponing, Yay! which I can just imagine Doug doing digital couponing on top of physical couponing. Um, yeah, it's, <laughs> it's gonna be amazing. Uh, and then Drew, Drew is still just playing Call of Duty all the time. Uh, the food pantry called me and they said that they need some volunteers. Uh, so this is a great opportunity for people looking to be of service, which is vital to your recovery. So uh, the food pantry in, in River West, uh, local, uh, go there, help them out. They're looking for some help. So if you don't have a job or you just want to be of service or if you're playing video games all the time, this is a great opportunity for you to, to expand a little bit, right? Go outside your comfort zone. Um, okay, so this weekend, uh, I said that we we're going to have the Halloween, Halloween costume party. And so here's what it's gonna look like, right? So here's what the contest looks like, the contest part. I don't know what you guys are gonna do in your own separate houses, but here's what the contest looks like. You're gonna go off and you're gonna get some appropriate um, costumes, right? So like, I, I don't know why people always think that slutting it up <laughs> is like what, what makes it more scary, right? Like if you're gonna be a zombie, just being a normal zombie is fine, right? Like if you're gonna be a nurse, that's great. Like nurses are heroes. Uh, they're frontline workers. You, you don't have to slit up the nurse to make it better. 
Okay, so so let's just make it appropriate, all right? Um, and, and so you're gonna go off, get some costume, go to Goodwill, search people's you know closets or dressers or wherever it might be, and and get some put put some costumes together. Okay, take a picture and then text it to me by midnight on Friday. On Sunday, I'm gonna post those pictures on the 4D community page and then let the vote start. So past 40 people vote. Um, Current 40 people vote, and the winning house gets fabulous, fabulous prize, okay? I don't know what that is yet, but you guys are gonna get it, and it's gonna be fabulous, okay? So, um, so yeah, so Saturday, dress up, midnight, post, vote, all right? You guys, are, it'll be great, it'll be great. Uh, and then last but not least, we have resident of the week. Every week we look for a resident who has done something amazing um, or has shown significant growth or is just a model 4D community member. Uh, we talk about it on, on Wednesday and, uh, and then we talk about it again sometimes. And then finally we pick the person and say, all right, well, well why? And then the manager of that house will text me reasons why that person deserves resident of the week. All right, so here is what that manager texted me and I'm just gonna read what he said. All right, so it's, it's from one of the guy houses. Uh, first, uh, he is putting his spiritual growth first, sharing it honestly in meetings and making separate priority with his sponsor that he contacts daily. Uh, he mans up to his responsibility and is a hard worker. He gets up at 5 a.m., takes a 90 minute bus ride to work, then comes back and is grateful for it. Uh, he always does his chore, follows all the COVID rules, and is always positive and cheerful. And uh, even he's cheerful even when he was put back on shadow status <laughs> for forgetting to put his coat post curfew. Uh, he always makes the house happier and more grounded. That is way more than three reasons. So this guy definitely deserves it. And it goes to Chad. Congrats, Chad. That's awesome, dude. Um, yeah, that's a lot of growth for you. So, so I'm happy to hear that that it's working out. Uh, and so, what do you get, right? So you get no chore, which is great. Um, you don't have to do a police duties, which it sounds like you suck at them anyway. So that's awesome that you don't have to do that. And you get a free fuck off night, a night where you, you don't have to do anything. You do whatever you want. Um, and so, well, any anything within within boundaries, right? So anyway. There you go, welcome, uh, so now congratulations, Chad. And that's all I got, that's all I got for today. Again, have a great week, have a, have a good time, and, and find some freedom in the spirit. And thanks, man, take it away.